Welcome aboard. I'm Captain Jake, and we're back with another episode of Field of Glory Kingdoms. This game was developed by Ajod and published by Slytherin. So let's go ahead and get into uh, our scenario here that we're playing. We are still playing as Scotland. We're playing through it, and seeing how far we can get. Let's see where we're going. Right now, uh, we lost our king last time, the old age. And we have a new guy, and he's been on the throne for a number of years. And we'll check all that part out again and uh, see what we're going to do here. So, all right, here's our Army 79. Uh, yep, need to be building that up. Let's see. Well, when the hand to speed up the heart going wait to add it good next you were particularly harsh yeah we know that received a new regional director forfeit claim france and england yes we got that and then here okay now this guy is should be part of us by now and i did not get a chance to um look it up as to why it's striped but it doesn't matter here we've got nine units and their population is scott and their petty kingdom of the Man, uh, let's see what they're producing. Uh, they got some roads. Good. It's a fair season for turn 24. Move it up. Let's go here. Forfeiture claim. It says... It says... The claim we have on a given land is uh, becoming a thorn in our side and might draw us into an unwanted war. Uh, okay, that is one that we want, actually. Look at, oh, we already have that one. What we really would like is the upper islands here. There you are, squad. No, no, it's not what I wanted. Thank you. Down here, I have no idea why we want to have this one. Oh, uh, it gives me one. I that claim. I don't need that. Don't want that. So, looks like we're going to go here. Uh, remove report. Let's just take a look here what our diplomacy is. We're at war with Sutulan. We want cooperation. Right click all these. Okay. Let's see we're at war with. But I'm not going up there. I think we're gonna have to declare war on Island Man. We got 16, we got 70. But I want to wait just a little while here. Let's look how long has he been on the throne now. Uh, nine turns, four years. Okay, 46 administration, military piety. his loyalty is. Health is good. Unknown. Ah, it's the opposite way. I thought the gray would be coming down. Okay, good. Don't know what he... What is he? 
a military, oh, he's a peaceful dude. Well, we don't want that. But he's administration of loyalty and piety. Uh, relative change to pillage of reason after a lot of decreases by 10%. Let's head off to nine for five up to four. Yep. No domestic spy special, no domestic spy networks. Oh, we need that. Uh, vassals, allies, we got one enemy. We have nine regions, two domains, one with a peer of the realm. I wonder if we can offer to make them a vassal. Lost 72% in five turns. Yeah, we did. Okay, in five, manpower overflowing, metals overflowing. Okay. No, let's go here. Oh, there we go. Well, hopefully, we really want to spin that. All right, this guy. Now, can we offer him go to diplomacy? Worth barren fields. None. Is it war? Back. They have to answer your opinion. No other actions possible. Okay. Well, that's good to know. And down here. Minimum garrison. Got nine units. We should be able to. I think I have to declare war on him first, but let's take him and move him to here. No, as far as I want to go. Now we are making money, making money. All right, good. Plus minus three in the money. Oh well. Go ahead and finish this turn and let's see what happens. We saw some ship head off. Okay, well, looks like we got progress token. We're up to fifth again. All right, and we are making more money. Good. Check. Uh, there's at least one ruler. Now that we have one ruler on the battlefield, it says uh, then national authority changes will be doubled for both the winners and the losers. Okay. And yes. Okay. What do we have here? Felt our offer was not and rejected it. Well, okay, fine. Scotland is the ban. All claims of London currently owned by England. Relationships are easing between the two nations. Yes. And new claim. In a bold, St. Andrews demands uh, recognition of Suitland as the rightful territory of Scotland. Okay. Where is that? Oh, is that where I think it is? Oh, that's Shetland. Uh, where is that? Well, is that it? Uh, no. Where the hell did he... Where the hell did he make that claim? Oh. Well, that's okay. They did not, they rejected it. Regional will recruit non-standard units, okay. So, 
seem to be good here. Now, can we move into here? Uh, passage rights. Well, but I want all this land. So we're going to have to go to neither. Okay, diplomacy. Declare war. You enter a war with this nation on the next turn. There is an authority cost to pay, depending on how. We share the same faith, minus 7. We have no claim within their territory, minus 12. They are insignificant, too. We will lose 17 by declaring war in this nation. Oh, that's horrible. Uh, Hmm. Well, I want to lay claim then. How do I make a claim on it? All right, let's get rid of this. Or do I have a claim on it already? Let's look here. Get rid of this. Uh, refugee, refugee free supply per turn plus 12 duration. Man foreign claim. Thanks. So how do I... How do I lay claim to something? Let's find out. Well, if I go here, can I just do transactions? Like regions to gift money, uh, proposal can either be to consult, offer a gift, passage rights, royal marriage. Marry his son, a very important noble to target the realm when the ruler of the nation dies as his king. Okay. Now, let's try it here. Let's do to diplomacy. Uh, peace. Um, all right. Well, we want to yeah. give metal. Uh, no, send the units. Region is a claim, and the goal is to reduce tensions. So we'll add all regions here. Okay, concessions. Well, as that's to become their vassals, we'll be able to forge new alliance. No, well, let's ask. All right. That's what we're asking. Right now, don't want, this is the harsh season, so we're not gonna go in there. Now, I wonder if we could Try to marry off a daughter. I don't know if that's possible. Uh, okay, fortification level.
Okay, offer a gift. Uh, let's see, now where is... Royal marriage. Propose a royal marriage. Hmm. Not yet. Let's go ahead to the next turn and see what happens. Back to fair season. Okay, clergy. Population, unless heretic, favors expertise the odds of religious conversion in the region. Same for nobles. Okay, yeah. All right. Uh, and we always get that one check. Now, what do we have here? Sufferings, intense, the Lord must call for immediate instruction of. With Scotland suffering from internal tensions, the Lord of Ross? Really? Let's see what that was. Immediate construction of a reinforced palisade. Interesting. Okay. How my troops are doing here. Yeah, flag looks kind of beat up, but. Okay, fair season. Trying to marry somebody off to here. And what we need to do here now is. We know what's going to happen. So go here. Diplomacy. Declare war on. We will lose 17 authority for declaring war. Well. Okay. We're asking to declare war on another nation. No. No, no, that's not true. War. All right. Man and the Isles, yes. Yes, we have. Okay. That should we look at here. Uh, defensive and recruitment buildings. Nobles will mostly focus on unit recruitment. No. That's it. New balanced and balanced. Okay, perfect. All right. Well, we're going to war. Let's see what happens. And we had a bunch of ships running around. The flag is back up because we had a harsh winter. We're up to five. And we're down here. Automatically result in wars for the participants. Okay, well, well, we know about crusades and we know about that. So let's find out. Crumbling bottom tier aging tokens to chance of receiving. Well, we're up to two thirty. Legacy falling behind. Okay, the ruling of our realm is insufficient with income and divided. Scotland is now regressing. Disorder tier reach. Oh crap. Well, that's no good. From England, you flout your divine moral laws and knowing that Isle of Man is not without formal allies, both terrestrial and celestial. Okay. Now, what do we have here? Ah, uh, boys have returned. Rejected the offer. Yep. The drums of openly. Yep, that is right. What do we have here? Rumors of marauding spread the world. Tudelin is taking action by ordering Ember Keep. Okay. Uh, too bad. Spread. 
Make an action by ordering to turn. Okay, timber keep. Okay, well. All right, we're moving into there with 79. We should be okay, I hope. And we're still balanced. And we'll see how things go. I like just going to war, so. We're heading off to the next turn. Thought. Yeah. Oh, 50 now. He coming out to fight. Okay, we're back up here. Now we're back up to stable. Jack and check. Yep, know about that. Let's close this one. Ooh, new guy. Robert met with us and pledged allegiance to the ruler. Oh, really? Check. Okay. Ah, oh, sons and daughters. Okay. Let's see who's loyal. Unknown. Health. Charge. Old death. Wow. Robert came. What happened? I want to know what happened. Tell me what happened here. Hepburn is offering his services to Robert. Uh, authority and disorder. Uh, by dawn first light, more of St. Andrews was discovered lifeless. Though his demise was swift, it appears to have been work of nature's course. Oh, damn. Okay. All right. Hmm. Okay. What happened to my horses? They are not in there, so... All right, well, I've declared war on them. Are we going to war or not? I'm not trying to, what are they, in the armies? Siege, are they all in the siege of all defender? Siege duration is uncertain. Unbreached wall again. Well, crap. Okay, well, let's go to decisions. We have the art of the siege. Cost me 50. Yep. Okay. Boy, that's what we're doing. We gave everything balanced. We're looking good. The rest of the places, go ahead and go. Bad general often leads you defeat whatever your army size. That is true. Check and check. Uh, a Ross competent noble who has ordered order construction of Anchorage in Scotland. Yes. Okay. While well, sieging, managed to destroy zero bushels of food within the city via the siege engine environment while well, besieging. Scotland did not manage to inflict casualties. No. Attacker 20, defender 16, minus 4. I hate that I have to seize the damn thing. Okay. Well. No hard season, but 
see no reason to change anything right now. But we'll just move on to the next turn. Okay. Well, what's the money is coming up? Now we have received a new remove. Yeah, let's see what that is. What does remove civilized mean? Decision to ensure to remove one impeding impediment representing a civilized group of people in a manner that does not involve some sort of bloodshed, coercion, or spotification. It's fair game though. Examples of such structures are generally commercial enclaves. Region must have it be removed. Okay, well, well, they're down. So our siege is working. So that's good. Okay, from peasants to freemen. Motivate troops. Fair season. We're going to motivate the troops. Uh, tribal. Let's see. Develop region. We're going to develop. Hope that's just 12 and 12. Developing that region. And that part of the domain. Right here from this timber of Superland and Penny Lord's confident we be much more effectively administer the populace, okay? And what was that one? You received regional removed civilized thanks to efforts of building extra military structures. Our military expertise has increased. Now I was hoping they would come out and fight, but apparently they're not. So we are building up. Let's. Now, do I have relatives? Sister, age 31, loyalty. Let's go ahead and. Try to marry her off again to these guys. Diplomacy. Back. Okay. Yeah, see who wants to become a vassal. Well, we're going to try again. All we can do. And now. 72 seems to be good. They're decreasing. They're down to three. Let's go ahead and end the turn. Uh oh. What happened there? That's going to be interesting. Let's blow this one away. Okay, check. All right. Now, what do I have here? 
Robert has met with Lord Fraser and Pledge of Allegiance to Ruler Check. The Siege of an Anvil Isle of is over in Scotland, stands victorious. Good. Uh, Scotland's great discourse motivated his troops there while besieging uh, Ar Arguil. Scotland inflicted a lot of casualties against the fed of man. Hold on, uh, I've been shattered, but we have claimed it in the name of our nation. The siege of and victorious. All right, man. Hold on. Yep, and. Okay, so now. What do we have here? Six and forty nine, really. Uh, population seven, unbreached wall. Right click uh, to access the garrison. All right, twenty four here. Yeah, he's got a compound power of forty eight. And this guy's got a combat power of 56. Mm. Mm, this guy's got a combat power of 49. Mm. Really? Mm, I don't think I like that. So first off, we're going to go here. And no, we want to go here. Oh, yeah, 89. We want to recruit local units here. Uh, why is it not owned? Oh, okay. Okay, so you're telling me uh, I'm going to have to look out how to how to right. Okay Trying to besiege that at all. Okay, besieged. Okay. This could be interesting. I'm going to have to look up how to capture, and I'll do that after the fact. How do you capture?
Hmm. All right. Well, make a note here. Capture province. See how we do that for next time. All right. Let's go next. Okay. It says Isle of Man, seven units, ten units. All right, we're going to export the battle. Overwrite exported battle, yes. And exit uh, kingdoms now, launch field of glory too. Yeah. All right, took a little while for that uh, screen to come up, but it finally did come up here. So Scots versus Scott Isles. Okay, so we are recording and enemies offer an open battle. And for those that are new watching the battle here, we have to route the enemy army by routing at least 40% of their troops and 25% more than you lose or routing 60% of their troops. Turn one of 24 turns, remaining 23 is off, offered open battle. We're in the deployment mode, so we can drag our units around where we need to. And first thing we need to do is see what, um, what we have as far as troops here. We have Scottish mercenary spearmen. They are undrilled. They're heavy fit. They're unmaneuverable, conform square. All right, that would be against cavalry. Okay. And if I remember correctly, disorders heavy. Let's see. Heavy, yeah, disorders them, so we don't want there. We'll move them to here. All right, here we have a sub general. We have sergeants. Here we have light archers, light archers, light archers, light archers. Light archers and light archers okay we got a bunch of archers there's the enemy front lines over here we have light archers all around also and here we have our sergeants sergeants okay Can I deploy these guys? Okay. I think I'm going to deploy them on a reverse slope here. Because, uh, except for light archers. Not open, sir. Mounted elephants, heavy or, de or determined foot and war wagon disorders. Others, except for light foot. Right. Well, we'll have to assume that that is good. I don't. Not for archers to be fighting woods. So, and our sergeants can be moved up. Now come over here. Okay. Looks like our man radius. No. Nope. That is I go command range of oh, oh, this guy. And select this guy. All right. 
that's where I can see. And line of fire. Okay, I think that's a good setup. Let's go ahead and and turn. All right. All right, there he's coming in here. We have uh, medium foots. My turn. Okay. Medium foot, undrilled heavy foot in the center. Let's, well, let's zoom in here so we can see. Then we have the undrilled here, offensive spearman. Then we have average lightly paired light spear, 50%. Wow, there's a lot of those guys. Not low. These is Highlanders. Uh, interesting. Okay, I don't have to worry about forming squares. These are spearmen. What do we have here? Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to move up. Here, ah, shit. Oh, damn it. But I had selected the other unit. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to give all these guys a chance to shoot. So we're going to move him here. Okay, and then we'll use our shock troops here. Well, let's do that. Let's see. They don't have any ranged attack weapons. So that's good. Okay, now. Well. Now my question is, is are we, is something else moving up here? I don't see a reason to move right now. So let's just, Maybe somebody will pop out of the woods up. Oh! Interesting. Okay. we talking about quite a few so we're going to move him to here yeah. 
that we want to shoot at him. Unprotected bow. Interesting. Now I can move through him and then possibly still shoot at him, or I could leave him right there. Now let's click on this edge unit. Yeah, because we definitely can't get engaged in hand-to-hand -hand with these guys. We'd get our ass kicked. Okay. So, how far are they going to move up? I don't think they can get to me yet. So, let's go ahead and end the turn. something that I can't see. Okay, well, let's This guy over to here. He's experiment heavy foot. And then over here, I didn't think I hit this guy, but this is the guy I'm going to have to hit now, see? What I only hope I can do is... Held firm. Good, and they're disrupted. That makes them, their attacks weaker. That's good. And I think that's it. No, this guy right now is. I don't know if I can move him up to here. No. Move him to here. That's it, I do believe. Uh, crap. I miss this guy? Uh, where'd he go? 
I did. Oh, crap. Hey, let's see that guy back there. Damn it. Oh, well. Keep on coming up then. Damn it. Those be the perfect guys I need to get involved. Shoot. Oh, good. Mm-hmm. Only two. Guys, they evaded. All right. Well, that's interesting. So, I guess I can shoot at him. What do you think? Well, I guess I can only shoot at him. Good. Now this guy. Yeah. I'm going to leave him sitting right where he is, not doing nothing. These guys. They'll lose. Which is interesting. This guy. This guy, he's going to lose too, my goodness. I don't know which one I want to turn that unit to. Hmm. Okay, now back up there. Alright, and this guy. Now let's see which way we're going to move, which way we're going to go. Okay. Okay, and this one, do I have any movement points left? No, no, and no. Okay, could get a, could end up having a flank attack there. I don't think that's what I want. All right. Oh. Glad I checked.
Okay. This guy, yeah, uh, but. That is it. Okay. Now we'll do next turn. Let's see what they do. Boom. They disrupted my guy. Falls back. Three to three. Come on, my sergeants. And not a great. Not great. All right. Well, they charge again. That should allow us to do better. No, nope. one to two. Not great. Okay. All right. <clears throat> now let's see what we got going on here. We'll save this and start next time. Bring this unit up because we're an idiot and didn't see it sitting back there these guys lost four these guys are down three but they still got three turns of ammunition left so we're gonna go up what we're trying to do is get lucky and kill their leader and now this guy is in a melee so if we can move him we might be able to do that over here, we are definitely going to just concentrate on all my shots on this guy. Maybe we can get him to break, which would be great. That weakens this side. Yep, 242, 244, yep, 34 down a little bit there too. And these guys probably can't charge. These guys didn't charge. So that's where we're going to leave it. So let's go ahead and save our game dots B. dots number one okay save now we will Exit, uh, we're going to quit this game. Okay, we're back to this screen now. Just because we are playing Field of Glory Kingdoms and we left off with that battle. So, we will pick up next time with uh, Field of Glory in Medieval and continue that battle of Scots versus Scots. Uh, they're trying to take back that area up north that we captured and we have to research how to capture a province so once we have that answer we'll be back with another episode real soon hopefully you enjoyed today's episode so as always i am captain jake wishing you fair winds and following seas until next